door. My room is room B. There's A, B, C, and D in each apartment. So I'm gonna go ahead and open the door. Each room has like a lock. Use your card to open it. So this is what my room looks like when you walk in. Here's the front door and then my bathroom is like right when you walk into my room. My bathroom's like in my room. I'm gonna be showing that to you guys after. This is when you first walk into my room. I put an over the door hanger above my door. And as you can see, it's kind of falling apart. I got a lot of stuff hanging here, so I just keep my bags for the park, like this one, some other bags, and my pocketbook and stuff. I think that I got that over the door thing at like five below. Next to my door, I have this little section. I have my Epcot 40th poster. This was a pin that I got. My mom and my dad got it for me when I graduated college. That's a photo of me and my grandma. This is a dry erase calendar. I need to update it. I just put my schedule on there and just like some goals for the day and that sort of stuff. And I have this magnet on here from the Disney Alumni Association I got when I had my final bow when I graduated from my program. And then I also have string lights going around there. I have two Epcot maps, the 40th and the food and wine. I also had the holidays one, but it fell off. It's kind of hard to stick things to the wall, but everything else I used command strips. So all the stuff you see hanging up. And then this was something that I painted myself. I made one for myself and each of my roommates. So we all have this matching canvas in our room, which is kind of cute. And then as you move over into my room, this is what the rest of the room looks like. So there's this wall over here. I'll go in depth with everything, but this is what the rest of my 4x4 room looks like. I'm gonna continue on this wall. I have all of these vintage looking like Polaroid inspired frames inspired by all the old movies. And then I have more over here. So there's like Little Mermaid, Beauty and the Beast. I found all of these on Pinterest and printed them out at um, Walgreens. And then in the center, I have these three prints right here also from Pinterest. And I got the frames at Dollar Tree. Down here I have a trash can, it's kind of overflowing right now so we're going to ignore that. And that is from Target I think, it was like $5. And then I have this Christmas tree that's just been here for the past few months. So it's kind of sitting there right now if anyone's interested in it or else I might just throw it out or donate it. And then I have this drawer right here. They give you this four drawer dresser. So I, it was in the corner of my room I believe when I moved in and I just left it there. I think it's a good spot especially because it has my TV on top. So it comes with four drawers. My top drawer it's just a bunch of t-shirts and workout shirts and tank tops. Second drawer is my shorts and my leggings like comfortable shorts. This is the third drawer, it just has some more leggings and like denim shorts. The bottom drawer, I just have pajamas. They hold a lot of stuff, which is really nice. And then I have this TV, I had this throughout college. It's kind of tiny, but it does the job. And I love watching Disney Plus on here. Then I have this lava lamp right here. It's not plugged in right now. And then I have my Mickey Scentsy Wax Warmer. I also have this cup from Disney Programs. I didn't really know where to put it, so that sits right there. And then here's my pin board. It's kind of empty right now because we had a Flamingo pin trading event the other day at Flamingo Crossings. So I brought a lot of my pins there, but I still have some cute ones on here, like this one's one of my favorites for the 50th and I bought this one that I was part of the magic. The rest of them are some that I've just had from over the years. And then down here is all my celebrating buttons, not all of them, but some of them. Right above my TV is this Mickey shape decoration with my name on it. My mom's best friend got this for me and I absolutely love it. There's string lights around it and I think she got it on Etsy. And then also hanging from this is this little ornament that a guest gave to me during Christmas. Christmas time. It says thanks for making magic. It's super cute. And then next to it is this small world vintage poster that my friend that used to be in the program got for me. I love how it kind of goes with my room theme of like old vintage Disney. That was the vibe I was going for. There's just string lights going from one end to the other and those string lights are from Amazon I believe. These are the windows. My room, every room is a little bit different. Like I've noticed my roommates even in a 4x4 it's a little bit different. But my room has three big windows, which is really nice. And they come with blinds. I'll show you guys what the view is outside my apartment. It's not really anything like super nice. It's kind of a cloudy day right now. But that's what it looks like. You could kind of see the walkway to the community center. You could still see people walking around. There's a golf cart going by. So over here, I have my little piglet that 
my boyfriend Michael got for me. Print from Pinterest as well that says you're the magic that I printed at Walgreens. Then I have a fake plant over here and a real plant over here. And then this was from Christmas time as well, but it's from uh, Target or Five Below, I think. And it is supposed to be a Christmas tree, but I think it still looks kind of cute. And then I also have this plant right here. She's kind of on her last leg, so I think it's time for her to go soon, sadly. Then is all my um, crystals. Usually they're better organized, but they won't all fit in here, obviously. And the second little windowsill, I got this Flamingo light because I live at Flamingo Crossings, and my friend got that for me. Next is this Disney Programs, my graduation cap that I got when I had my final bow. And this was the first hat that I got when I became a cast member. So I have both of these. I also have this stitch light that changes color. The next one, oh, I have another. I forgot, I have two of these. Um, I have another Disney Programs hat. Another little plant. I think this was from like Dollar Tree or Five Below. And then I got my Eeyore. He's so cute. He's one of my favorite characters. And then I got this little turtle. His name is Franklin. So that is pretty much my window section. And then I have these little prints. Again, they're all from Pinterest. Some of them are from like small shops that I screenshotted. I think this one too. And then more Dollar Tree frames with prints in them. Again, going for that like pastel retro Disney vibe. There's me. Sorry that my voice is kind of raspy right now. My allergies have been killing me. We're gonna go on to the closet right now. This is what the closet looks like in Flamingo. There's two double doors. And going around my closet, I just put these plant garlands. And there's two big doors. The closet is actually really big. So we're gonna go in here. The doors are sliding. So again, there's two of them. And there's a lot of space. I thought that I brought a lot of clothes, but my clothes actually only take up half and then the other half like the other door over here is my like costumes i did a lot of doubling up on hangers so like over here for example there's like three shirts hanging on the same hanger just to like save some space and save some hangers too so i didn't have to buy as many up here i have my sweatpants and then just folded up hoodies and like spirit jerseys there's a lot of space up here it goes all the way up and here i have this three drawer dresser forget where my dad bought it i think it might have been at target i recommend it in the top drawer i have bras in the middle drawer i have underwear and then in the bottom drawer i have my socks so i have all that right here next to this on the floor that's a storage crate of all my bathing suits all the way on the bottom these are all my shoes i never got like a shoe organizer or a shoe rack i didn't really need one because i have so much closet space so they're just all organized just right here on the bottom of the closet And then this is the other side. Here's all of my costumes. I'm gonna have to return all these at the end of my program, so sad, but this one is Animal Kingdom. I got Marvel, Fantasyland, and a few others. And then up here, these are all my costume hats. And then in this little storage crate, I have sheets, pillowcases, blankets, and then we'll go on to my bed area. So next to my closet, this picture never wants to stay on. But this is a picture of Epcot that I got from working there. In between my bed and my closet, this is my laundry bag. It's just a bag from like a local dollar store as well. And then of course, here's my bed area. I really love how it looks. It's my favorite part of my room. Over here I have my ears. I hung them up with command strips and command hooks. I ran out of command hooks and I just never bought more. So these aren't all my ears, but they're most of them. I got all of my stuffed animals. We got Stitch, we got Angel, Tigger, my Care Bear. And then this was a Mickey pillow that I won in a Instagram giveaway. It's really cute. My comforter is from, pretty sure this one's from Wayfair. I really loved the color. It reminded me of like Cinderella. And again, that's kind of the vibe I was going for in my room, like vintage retro Disney. And then all my decorations above my bed is there's some old Disney films the covers of the films with some lights, leaves, and I got a flower garland up there. And then this one right here, the Samantha name tag is a magnet that they give you on your first day when you move in. So I put that above my bed. And then there's a dream catcher above it. 
and then there's a few more over here and I added these as well just hanging down I hung them I tied them from the lights hanging lights are from Amazon and then these are from Amazon as well the the leaves Next to the bed is a nightstand provided by Flamingo. So this is actually adjustable. You can raise it higher if you wanted to and use it as a little desk. So I have my princess lamp here. If you guys saw my move-in video, I think it was, you know that Cinderella's head fell off, which is so sad. Um, but this has been my lamp since I was a baby. I had it when I was a baby. And of course it has the princesses on it. So I brought it down, but while we were moving down, Cinderella's head fell off. So it's kind of creepy looking, but it's still cute. So, and it's so funny because I didn't know how many people had this same lamp. So comment if you had this lamp growing up because apparently a lot of people did. It was a really popular lamp. Then I have this Magic Kingdom map coaster that I made actually at one of the children's activities rooms at the Riviera. This is just a storage crate of like stuff. Just kind of like medicine and stuff I guess. And then this is my diffuser. Changes color. Here is my ocean galaxy light and it makes the room look so pretty at night especially. It's light outside right now so can't really see it too much. You also have storage under this, and this rolls this whole cart. There's um, wheels on it, which is nice. This is just like kind of like electronics, and my books are in here. This is what's keeping all of my lights and my lamp and everything plugged in. So I recommend getting a bunch of these. The outlets are kind of like the outlets all the way under the bed. And then under here, these are two more drawers that Flamingo provided. And this one, I just have a bunch of like random stuff, like electronics. And then this drawer. It's the same one. This is just a big crate with like Disney stuff in it. So literally anything like I've received during my program like this water bottle. Over here is a little storage bin with glasses in it and then over here is my jewelry bag with all my jewelry. So that's all that's in that drawer. So that is it for what my bedroom looks like. But after this we're gonna go inside my bathroom and I'll show you guys what that looks like. Again this is the front door of the room. Here's my bed and then the bathroom is right here. Every 4x4 is a little bit different but this is what mine looks like. But here's the bathroom, got my own bathroom. There's a shower with a tub which is nice, big cabinets, towel, comes with a plunger, a lot of storage and mirrors. In the back of the door is this towel with a little hook. Here I have a little mermaid print. I think the frame is just from Dollar Tree. Another towel and then two more prints. And the bathroom comes with a lot of space. So there's these two cabinets down here. So I just have like cleaning supplies and sunscreen and extra bathroom stuff. And then there's this cabinet hanging on the wall and it has four shelves so you could store stuff in there as well. And there's a ton of space on top here. And then here is a big mirror. And then here is yet another medicine cabinet. This one has three shelves so as you can see there's so much space. I just have my perfumes in here in this little crate some other stuff and then this was a painting that I made I just have that there and then yet another little print and then here's the shower you'll either get a bathtub which I have or just a regular shower with a door and I believe each shower comes with four shelves and they also come with a shower curtain although I believe you can provide your own as well next to it is this little towel rack they provide so I have my towel and then I hung up this moon mirror from, I think it was from Five Below. 